Hi, this is Bob Irving from Liberty Trike, and I'm going to show you today how to swap out your spoke wheels for the new mag wheels. The reason I was chosen for this video is because I'm a manager here, so I don't really work on bikes. And I imagine most of you don't work on bikes. Now, down here you have the tools that you most likely have in your house. It's an adjustable wrench, a flathead screwdriver, and this is a three millimeter Allen wrench. You may or may not have one. They're not very expensive. When you get your, when you get your trike, your, your mag wheels, I mean, you're going to get two additional washers and those are important. So hold on to those. For the purpose of this video though, I'm going to use our tools because I can do it faster. So I'm taking your Liberty trike stand. I'm lifting the bike and putting the stand under the bike so that the wheel is free. You always want to start with the left rear wheel. You start with the left rear wheel because if I'm, if when I start working on the nut, this wheel is going to want to rotate. So if I start here, I can hold this one while I'm working. Additionally, I put the emergency brake on so that the trike doesn't roll. So let's get started. You take your flathead screwdriver, you insert it into the packing hub cap, pull it off. You notice you have a bolt here. So what you want to do is you'll take your adjustable wrench and fit it over the bolt. And you'll undo the bolt. I mean the nut, I'm sorry. See, you can tell I'm a manager because I don't have all the terminology. There's a washer there. You want to pull that off. Then you pull the wheel off. Sometimes you have to wiggle it. Sometimes you have to bang it. Now, here is a black spacer. This black spacer also comes off. What you want to do is take one of the, one of the washers that came with the trike, I mean with the mag wheels, you slide it on, you slide on the spacer, and now the way to tell if you have the correct wheel for the correct side is you look at the inflation, the inflation nozzle. It should be pointing slightly outward. So this one obviously goes on this side. You slide it in. Again, you may have to jiggle it or, or shimmy it. You take a washer, the one that was there originally, you put it back on and then you take your nut you tighten the nut on. And you want to make it snug, but you don't want to over tighten it. You don't want to go beast mode on this and make it too tight. It's just got to go until you feel it get real snug like that. And if you want, take your cap. Slide it back on. Now let's go over to the other side. The first, oops, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take the stand and I'm going to lift up this side of the trike so that this wheel is up in the air. I take my flathead screwdriver, pop off the packing cap. And again, same thing. I'm going to loosen or undo the nut on this side. And under the nut, there is a washer. I'm going to pull off the spoked wheel. Again, you notice how I'm jiggling it to get off. Sometimes it's on there pretty tight. Then you're going to have what's called the dry flange. The dry flange has three prongs sticking out of it. And that's because we have holes on the back side of the wheel. It's important for me to take this dry flange off. 
That's where you use your three millimeter Allen wrench. You don't have to unscrew it all the way, just enough to slide it off. And inside, there's a little channel in the axle. And there's a key. It's called a key. It's really just a little piece of metal. You want to pull that out. Take the other washer that was provided with your mag wheels and slide it on. This one is a little tight, it's just so expediency, I'll use a different washer. There we go. You take your key and you put your key in the channel. Now, this set screw is what tightens down on top of that key. So you want the set screw to be right over the channel, just like that. Take your Allen wrench and make this puppy snug. That way it'll be on the key. Next thing you're going to do is you're going to take your wheel. Again, there's the inflation nozzle. It's pointing towards the outside. You're going to put this on. You may have to wiggle it. And then you want to try to line up the holes. Washer. Nut. And your other alternative, rather than you doing it yourself, is going to a bike shop. They'll be able to do this for you. Again, you tighten till it's very snug. You don't want to over tighten. And that's how you get your mag wheels. I want to thank Linda for being the camera operator. If you guys need help, please call us. Bye-bye.